yeah hello there and welcome back and let us continue with our lesson over here and the next step is we will be updating our theme over here to use a material tree so let's go on to the top over here and uh, i will be updating this one okay so let's go and create a new folder first of all and let's make this one as a core we will be following a clean architecture over here so let's make this one as a core and inside this let's add a new folder that we'll call this one as a theme and inside this theme let us add a new file and that file we'll call it as a, a color c o l o r color and uh, let's make this one as a schema so s c h e m e s schema study dot file and i have the code already and i will just copy that code and paste it over here so this is just the color code so you don't have to worry about it you can just grab it from my link i'll post the link below and you can get the link uh, you can get this code from that particular link and here i have just added a bunch of the colors so i don't want to waste your time to configure all of this color so we have the light theme color and i have make use of the color schema which comes from the material uh, the uh, material package over here and we have created a bunch of the colors over here like right? the brightness primary on primary right so i have defined all of these colors over here already so i have a dark color schema as well as for the light color schema so this we will be using for our light and the dark theme so let's go back to our project over here so once we have that let's go over here and let's replace this one with the uh to do app right so that is what we are creating over here and uh, let's on the data th on the theme we will just make this one as a uh, use the uh, material since we are using a, a mat we will be using a material tree over here use a material tree to be set it as a true over here which will help us to make our application compatible with the material tree or we will be using a material tree over here and i need to define a color schema over here that will be of the light color schema that we have defined over here so we have already defined the light color schema so we will be using that one and also we have the dark theme right so the, the dark thing that we have uh, i'll just copy the whole code from here so just grab that code and just paste it over here too and uh, i'll make use of the material tree on the dark theme too and here i have to make use of the uh dark color uh, sorry the arc dark color schema that i have over here and once i have that i, I guess we are good to go so now we have the theme and um, both on the um the dark and the light theme but we don't have an option to switch the theme currently and later we will add that option when we are working with our application we will let the user to choose whether they want to use a light theme or the dark theme for our application and currently uh, we can just run our application and let us try to test it so you can go to the run and debug mode from here and i'll create a json file for our launch and that will help us to run our application more smoothly so once we have the uh, launch.json file that is already created over here so it will create a dot vs code and it will add that file over here so once we have that let's go over here run and debug and i can just let me run the app on our device so let us open up our device over here so i have the uh, iphone 14 pro max over here which is of the stimulator so let us wait for the application to run over here and i guess that it should not be of the to do but it should be of the to do over here so we miss spelled over there that's fine so let us correct it to be a to do app and let us wait for it to complete the build for our application and now you can see that our application is running and now we have a material tree enabled app 
and you can see once we click on it you will have a counter app running so this is not the app that we are currently building but that's fine so we will be configuring it to make use of the to do app and uh, let's meet up in the next lecture till then have a great day